Hi, gentle Americans. Had a lettuce here. I just got home from my night at uh, Posh Bar, which is in the taint of Hell's Kitchen. And uh, I had a good time. I did my show, so you think you can dance drunk. It's not rocket science. And I get a whole bunch of drunk people on stage just dancing and going crazy. And if they show their ass, they'll win the prize. And the prize consists of Boy Butter Lube, Michael Lucas Porn, and Intolite, the intimate skin lightning system, which is butt bleach, people. Yes, butt bleach. I've talked about it before in my videos, but this is the at-home kit where you can do it at home, slap a little on, and it knocks five shades off your old ass. And everyone wants a younger, fresher hold. Isn't it true? Really? So, while I'm there, I don't know, like, these guys get really horny there, and I, I ended up uh, kissing this Dutch guy at the end of the bar, and I'm really not into kissing people when I'm dressed like this, because first of all, my lipstick. My lipstick is very important to me. I do not like to go out on the street looking like I had a stroke. You know, I like to keep it kind of fresh, kind of real, and I have to pace them, and you can't pace drunks. You just can't, because they'll fucking eat your head off. That's what they do. That's what drunk people do. They have no boundaries, and if they start licking you like you're a fucking dirty lollipop. So, but then I come home, and the energy is done, and I try to wind down, and... I don't know. Sometimes when you get home late after it's done, you get a little sad. You don't even know why you're getting sad. You just happen to get sad. Uh, maybe because now you have to think about your life again. Because being in a bar like that with all the energy, it, I have to say, is a distraction. It distracts me from all the other things that may be going on in my life. And I have a lot of great things going on in my life. But it's this stuff, you know, personal stuff, which I don't like talking about on this, that I've been trying not to think of, and then you end up thinking about it after you get home, when all the energy is passed. So what do I do when I get home? I end up taking this off, I take a shower, I stretch. I'm very, very sensible. I know you don't want to hear this, but this is what I do. I stretch, I do some breathing, whatever I do. I put my moisturizer on, because I love my moisturizer. I have like three or four creams I put on my face. Oh my God. I, I, anything they tell me to put on my face. Well, not anything they tell me to put on my face, if you know what I mean. Yuck, yuck, yuck. Yeah, the bottom line is I'm still a tramp, I guess. And if there are any horny Dutch people out there that want to kiss me, I'm willing because I love a Dutch man. I love their height. They make me feel small and teeny. And when you're a girl like me, <laughs> you need to feel small and teeny sometimes because for the most part, I feel like Godzilla. Green hair, get it, you stupid bitches. Uh, but anyway, that's it for my night. I'll report back to you tomorrow because I'm doing the movie theater gig tomorrow. And I love you. I really do. I guess. Tell me if you love me. Bye.